So in my previous video, I went to the Hot Toys secret base to take a look at their latest displays for 2020, looking at the DC and Marvel characters. And in this video, we're going to check out the Hot Toys Rebel base. So even outside the store, there's plenty of artworks on display for photos as well as a mini exhibition with the current one being the Avengers Endgame. So this is their promotion area where they do change it up when there's a new product, but they currently have the Nano Gauntlet as well as a life-size Iron Man Mark 85 with its full gear. So this is the moment where you can admire the life-size Iron Man, take photos as well as check out their latest artworks for their Endgame figures. Outside the store window, there are more life-size displays, including another Iron Man from one of the previous movies. A replica of the Nano Gauntlet from the Avengers Endgame. And we have the life-size display of Captain America and also hologram effects showing off their movie trailers. We have more artwork displays of their figures for the Avengers Endgame to make up for the rest of their outside store. Round the corner opposite the entrance of the store, there is an absolutely amazing piece of artwork displaying the Avengers Endgame final battle, all made up of their Hot Toys figures. And now we can take a look at their action figures on display outside their glass cabinets, starting off with a few of the characters from the Avengers Infinity War. And more figures from the Avengers Infinity War line, including Thanos, Captain America and Iron Man. Something I noticed they took away from the Hot Toy secret base was the Holy Trinity from the Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice. Not entirely movie accurate, but one outstanding pose and definitely caught my eye is them trying to recreate that Superman battle with the rest of the Justice League. Of course, we're still waiting on the Cyborg figure. It is mostly dominated by the Marvel and DC displays, but there is a Star Wars section as well as the Cosbabies and plenty of accessories. If you'd like to see more toy hunts here in Hong Kong, you can check the links in the description below. It does include some previous visits to the Hot Toy Secret Base. I also included the links to my recent visit to Tokyo where I did plenty of toy hunts there, as well as more superhero toy hunts around London, including their mega stores and comic stores. And if you're into the 112 scale action figures, I have done plenty of reviews and news on the Tamashii Nation's SH Figure Arts characters. And stay tuned for the SH Figure Arts Avengers Endgame Final Battle characters. Thanks for watching and see you next time.